So I decided to uh, take out the clip I have as a documentary show you guys how to remove the C7 lower bumper fascia. Uh, you will need a body tool, um, use a plastic one or a flat head screwdriver with a towel over it so you won't scratch the paint. And next there's two bolts in there, you remove them on the upper ones. And of course the license plate bolt is also the one that holds the bumper together so you want to remove that. And next to the next to them there's two more bolts and there's two more bolts right above the exhaust tips inside. So there's total of eight bolts right now. If you have an impact driver it will be much faster. Then underneath on each corner there's three to four uh, hex bolts. Uh, you guys can remove those fairly quick and the bumper should come loose and the way to do it is to pull on the the fin next to it so because i do have AP, apr rear rear under tread for aerodynamic so I, I remove those so you basically pull on the mesh and they should come right out from the clips you don't have to worry about the brake then they're fairly easy you can tell from this image those are very long slotted uh clips mount to the bumper and uh, you can also tell the safety bumper have six bolts you remove them actually four bolts you can see where their location are and you pretty much finish removing them and uh, so done right now I'm putting them back just reversing the process I like to mount the top one first before I mount the bottom so I can hold the bumper back in place and the exhaust ones it's just a sequence I like to do I've taken this thing on and off at least eight times uh, nothing broke fairly easy simple to do if you need to install that say diffuser uh, APR under tray or need to wrap it or need to do exhaust tip job or exhaust system it's nice to remove this so it can get around easier because the bumper itself is wrapping around the tip so it's really hard for them to weld a new tip on or uh, exhaust tip or pull the exhaust system off without having to dismount the entire x-pipe so they can push around in this case you don't have to take out the x-pipe you can just um, basically just uh, um, yeah do the fascia much easier too I mean the 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 rear lower fascia is covered the muffler and it's uh, the wiring system for the valve the engine noise the engine sound valve it's also covered by the rear fascia so this way can, they can unplug and replug it easy with the impact driver everything makes easy um, it used to take me all day now only take me less than half an hour to an hour to do this then it's done